Hey guys, 1000 Grid here. Hey, welcome to my very first video. Yep, this is it. Um, I don't know what it is, but it's it. All right, anyway. So what I kind of want to do is just show regular knives that regular people use um, and, and not really do reviews, just kind of show you the knife, I guess. Because reviews kind of suck sometimes because people give you their opinion of the knife and some people are just way too picky and they shouldn't actually be buying knives because they're too picky or I don't know maybe they should make their own knives or something but anyway we're just gonna start um, if you want like super long reviews I'm sure there's plenty of other channels out there nothing fancy he's like crazy long man if you wanna watch an hour long video about a knife there you go do it right now I'm just gonna do first video and this one is yeah, Kershaw's new hotwire hold it this way so I tried to look on Kershaw's website for this knife and it's not there so I'm guessing they're either it's too new to be on their website or they're really embarrassed about it um, it's probably a little bit of both but anyways I totally picked this up for under 10 bucks seriously under 10 bucks little tiny knife not a little tiny but it's a decent size um, and the flipper on this thing super fast I mean this thing is amazing how fast it is come on There's the model. Haven't actually cut anything with it, um, but I have carried it a couple days, so uh, it's a decent little knife, especially for the price. I mean, Kershaw, I don't know what you're doing, but you got some cheap cheap knives lately, so or inexpensive knives. But yeah, the the flipper on this is like super quick. Probably even get it to go faster too. Um, sheep's foot, I guess, for the tip. Uh, CR13 or the 3CR13, which I guess is kind of like if you were to buy a knife at a gas station, this would be like a step up the metal, anyway. Um, the interesting thing about this one is that I noticed right off the bat it has like sandpaper. This is like, it feels like sandpaper. Even though it has these little this little design here or, or cutouts or whatever, but the the actual texture on it feels like sandpaper, and I love that. Uh, this would be the first knife I think that I, I have that, that has ever had anything like that, which is awesome. Um, And it's interesting because I just, like I said, I just bought this. And it's already got like a nick right there in the center. And I never even used it yet. So let's see, blade size is three. You know what? Who cares? It's a little tiny knife from Kershaw. It's under 10 bucks. Pretty centered. Pretty straight. No. Well, it's off a little bit. You know what? It's ten bucks. Who cares? Be a great uh, everyday carry knife. I did notice one thing though that the pocket clip is already loose. If you've ever owned Kershaw knives, you know that that happens usually pretty quick. So you got to take those little screws out and put some Loctite in them, and they usually last. But the uh, I did notice the pocket clip on this is super hard. Um, when you're trying to clip it on your uh, pocket. And I wear jeans and or dress pants and either one is super hard to clip on. So I think it's gonna shred my pants pretty quick. But other than that, I mean, it's 10 bucks. I don't know what uh, what we can expect anymore for 10 bucks, but it's pretty decent. So yeah, that's my first review. I don't know. Let me know if you want uh, 
more info in the videos or less or whatever, but uh, one down, a lot more to go.